Hi and welcome to next tutorial. Today we are going to look at how to create a decision table. So we have a sample question here and this is a decision tree. This is all about an ice skating rink and if you're under five years old and have your own skates you get a certain um, price for admission but if you're older than 13 and you need to hire skates you get a different price of admission. So to break this down, we have a few few things. We have conditions and we have rules. So how to actually draw a decision table? Well, the first thing you need to do is you need to break down and find out what are the conditions. And in this case, it's all of this stuff over here. We then have our final thing, which is our actions. And our actions are, you know, the end result pretty much. So to draw up a table, you can do something like this real simply in Word and you can have your conditions listed down with your actions and then you need your rules. Now your rules are simple, yes, no, um, tick boxes, crosses, things like that. So a completed decision table, you can see here that I filled it up with uh, these ticks and crosses. So for the first one, we can see that if the child is less than five years old, so less than five years old and has their own skates, they only pay $6. And you can see that here with this table. And if we keep going through, if we're under five years old, but you have to hire skates, then you are paying $9. And then you just work your way through that. So you will have to go through and list every explanation possible that could be considered in that decision table. Anyways guys, that was a quick tutorial on how to create a decision table. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.